Hey guys, DJ Lady S here. Happy Tuesday to you. Um, I went out, I did some shopping today, and then <clears throat> I went ahead and I cut my shopping short and decided just to save some of the shopping for tomorrow. So today's shopping trip took me to the 99 cent store, Tuesday morning, Michael's, and Walmart. And Walmart, I had to get some, um, you know, the usual household things and everything. And I also picked up my favorite peanut butter and uh, cheddar cheese crackers. I think I could survive on just those if I had to. So let's start. Oh, and I also went to Staples. So why don't we start with Staples? And because I'm still looking at their Martha Stewart stuff. I went to Staples, I think, yesterday. And uh, they're just revamping all of our staples and stuff. And a lot of their Martha Stewart stuff has really been condensed down to like almost nothing. But my other staples, which is just down the freeway, still has more Martha Stewart stuff on clearance. And I pretty much have everything. But I went ahead and I took a look at some stuff anyway. But while I was there in their clearance section, I saw these little cute post-it notes that are shaped like mushrooms. And you get two pads in there and here, and they each have 50 sheets on there. I also purchased this hedgehog uh, post-it note in pink. Same thing, you get two pads in there. And then I know I already have one of these, but this was marked down to, I believe, 50 cents because it's torn right here. I can... That doesn't matter to me you know it, it didn't take anything away from the actual composition book and its actual usage and then they had the Martha Stewart um, disbound filler paper eight and a half by eleven fifty cents and you get 50 sheets in here and what I've seen a lot of people do which duh I didn't think of this until I saw it on YouTube I can just cover these holes with washi tape and if it doesn't fit, I don't have the bigger arc. I just have the regular uh, Martha Stewart three ring uh, binder. I'll just put washi tape over these holes and just, just punch it with my three ring, uh, my three hole puncher and put this in my um, Martha Stewart the mask uh, binder. And then they had the, these are called permanent mailing labels and you get 42 labels. And so I was thinking I can make my own stickers. I'm going to put it through the printer and put like a fate decor on the back. And then um, I can go and, and make just different stickers and then just cut them out, either in a circle or a square or whatever. And I could just use that. I paid a dollar for that for 42 labels. And I paid a dollar for this one, same thing. But these are removable labels. Uh, same, same, same deal. Run it through my printer put a faint design on it and then I can either stamp an image on there or I can write on it however I want and then just you know make my own little my own personalized stickers for whatever I want uh, then my next stop was Staples Tuesday morning Tuesday morning and they put it in a big giant bag but it didn't need it to go in such a big giant bag now I thought these were interesting this is erase it's called Label Once 360. They're erasable, reusable labels for all your crafting ideas. And they're labels. Let me show you. They're labels, okay? And you get this pen and you get this eraser. Now, this is a permanent marker. It's not a special pen. It's a permanent marker. And But this eraser will erase the marker. So you can write anything you want on here. And then you could take this eraser when you're done, erase it, and just relabel it. So if you're using anything in your kitchen, if you're using, you know, putting things in your freezer, and you're going to use the same container again, you just erase it and then just write on there what you need it to be again. So you get 160 in different sizes. And then also, too, I was thinking I could use this in my Sherry Nietzsche, my day planner and everything. I thought this was a great idea if you put it on your dashboard. And if it was, because uh, they're reusable, you can, you know, um, well, I don't think you can peel them off when they mean they're reusable. It's like I can write over it again. I was thinking more, uh, it says permanent, permanent marker and label once eraser. So it's not uh, repositional. That's what I'm trying to say. But still, nonetheless, I think this is a great idea. So I paid $4 for that. 
and then oh I want I want you to see this my soul finds rest in God alone Psalm 62 1 I saw this and I was just like wow look how cute this is this is shaped like a handbag it has the Psalm 62 1 Bible verse on there my soul finds rest in God alone and then it has this really cute notepad and pen so let me open this up but this is you hear that listen to how sturdy that is it's like corrugated um, it's not flimsy it's not something that's just gonna you know wimp out and fall apart it stands on its own and you can put any notepad in here or you could just put like some fake flowers in there and then here's the the notepad and the pen that matches that I just thought this was just something special so I had to get that that just spoke to me then I found these post-it notes it says it's hard work being the queen amen you know it's exhausting it really is and these are what the post-it notes look like look at her she looks whipped and worn you know what I'm saying because it's hard being the queen these are self stick removable notes and I just thought that these were really really cute okay so I bought that I also purchased this cute little notepad here look at the eyelashes on this owl you know who loves owls right we all know um, look at this and then this is what you see the little rhinestone there and this is a little notepad and look at the sheets isn't that just delicious and yummy I love that I thought this that was really cute very nice to go in your uh, your purse and it doesn't say how many pages you get but this is by Molly and Rex so you get 75 sheets in here I also purchased, they only had one of these. This is a sticky note handy pack. You get five decorated sticky pads and three assorted sizes. So I thought that was really something. Look at that. These are post-it notes. And then I found some more of the We Are Memory Keepers um, journaling cards, four by six journaling cards. These are double-sided as well. And I, I just cannot get enough of these journaling cards uh, for some reason I'm just jonesing hard and I know hoodlums times four I make you laugh every time I say I'm jonesing about something but I am it's just who would have thunk that journaling cards would just you know it's like I, I gotta have them and what what am I doing with them I don't know but I just I just love the idea of them here's this one that really caught my eye again journaling cards but these are all black and white and gray and I just I'm loving these I'm loving these and these are double sided like I said look at that these are just a bit of wow I, I cannot get enough of these look at that I just love this black and white and gray I love that and then I purchased um, we know someone here that loves Paris, right? Here's another note card. Look at these. Look at this. Look how fantastic that those sheets are. Love that. I just, I saw it and had to have it. And then, look at this. I saw this and just, I was like, oh, gotta get it, gotta get it, gotta get it. It's a notepad, okay? But it's vertical instead of horizontal, and this is what the sheets look like on the inside. Can you see that? I love that. Uh, just, you know, put this on your your journaling page somewhere in a scrapbook, in your, your Hobonichis, your Midori travel case. And this is, uh, this is by Punch Studio. You get 100 uh, ruled sheets. So there are lines on here. You probably just couldn't see it because it's very faint but I purchased that and then I saw this one I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me Philippians 4 13 we all should know that first just like John 3 16 for God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son for those who believe in him shall have eternal life and these are what the pages look like on this isn't that beautiful so just remember I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me it doesn't matter who comes up against you if God before you who can be against you you know devil get behind me you have no rule here okay so always always have that on the forefront of your mind and then studio G journaling cards you get 10 and it just seemed like there was more in this pack but if it's 10 it's 10 and again just some more journaling cards that I just I had to have and so that was Tuesday morning and then I went to Michaels 
And I bought some more journaling cards, yes. First of all, let me show you these. These are recollections. They're kind of like smash book, you know, um, not smash book, but um, the smaller journaling cards for, like for, for uh, um, you know, just smaller ones. I'm, I can't get my thought straight. But here's what it looks like on the front, okay? And then these are just the smaller ones. These are just smaller journaling cards with just different, um, look at that speech bubble from the bird. And this was a dollar forty nine. Now you know what I could be paying quite a bit for this, but it was marked down from three ninety nine. But you know what? I like them, and this is just what I want. I like this size. And then um, I'll show you that afterwards. Then I saw this Project Life one hundred journaling cards. They're they're all grid cards. They're all grid. So I did like that. And you could do so much with this. And so um, this was on clearance for $2.49, marked down from $8.99. So I thought that was a really good deal for 100 of those. And then I bought some more Project Life cards, journaling cards. I know I already have this set. I showed you this before, but you can never have too many. So I purchased this pack. I also purchased this pack. This is called um, Tween. Okay, the other one that I just showed you, that was called Animals. This is Tween. So you have the 4x6 and 3x5 in there. <clears throat> Pardon me. This one is Journal. I already, I think I have two of these already, but I went ahead and I purchased another pack. And I already have this one too. This is School. I purchased that one as well. And then I saw these. These were over in the clearance section. These are called pocket pages. They're themed cards. You get 72 pieces. And they're just smaller, like, um, uh, Project Life cards or, you know, pocket pages by me and my big ideas. And this is what looks what it comes in the pack right here. <clears throat> you get 72 cards. Now, from what I understand, these are thinner um, consistency than your Project Life. I was saying I ran out of memory, so I had to go in and delete some videos. <clears throat> Excuse me. As I was saying, these, uh, it doesn't seem like there's 72 cards in here. So these are much thinner than your Project Life cards. So these are thinner, but there's 72 in here. And like I was showing you, this is what's inside this pack right here. Okay, so I purchased that. And that was $1.99 marked down from $5. <clears throat> Excuse me. Same thing with this one. This one has 72 cards by me and my big ideas. They're uh, pocket, um, pocket pages. And um, these are more of like your monthly uh, pocket pages. And these are what the cards look like inside of here. And this is what the front looks like. And so with, you know, Christmas coming around the corner and New Year's and everything. So I decided to go ahead and get this. And I like the fact that you have other things in this set uh, that has to do with other <clears throat> months of the year. I bought these... Um, Metal embellishments because I'm thinking I'm going to hang them from my Martha Stewart binders and my day timer and uh, other uh, planners that I have. And just these will be some of the charms that I would use to hang from that. And then I purchased another one of the Recollections, a little smaller pack of journaling cards. And let me, you get 24 sheets in here. And look how fun that is. Who, what, when. I For whatever reason, look at that birdcage. I am really just enjoying these, uh, I, I call them thought, thought starters or whatever you want to call them, prompts, and I just love that. I just think these are great. So that's just what some of those look like on the inside, okay? <clears throat> and then they have a lot of the Christmas stuff out right now. Um, my mother and I, we each have a village that we put up. Now she has... I think 19, no, I'm sorry. I think she has like 27 buildings. I have 13 buildings. Well, she's not putting up her village anymore, so she gave me all her buildings. And so now I get to create this whole fantastic winter village this year for Christmas. And so we have an open cove upstairs <clears throat> at the top of our, sta our stairs. Excuse me. <clears throat> and so we're going to put the village there if it fits. I mean, that's a lot of buildings, right? Either that or we're just going to take the dining room table out of the dining room or use the dining room table and put our, our, our winter wonderland village there. And um, uh, we'll call it Brinkerhoffville. Ah, 
So I'm, I'm real excited about that. We have roads and street lights or, you know, lamp posts. We have trees and bushes, uh, cars, trucks, a post office, oh, you name it. We have our own little town going on, okay? And I can't wait to put that up. I just love doing things like that. But anyway, so Michael's has their Christmas things out. And I really wasn't in the frame of mind to buy anything Christmas. But what I did start off to do is buy these little packs of tissues. Isn't that cute? And we have Christmas cheer on a Saturday. About, uh, sometimes it's the second or, or the third Saturday of every December. <clears throat> we have Christmas cheer where our friends can come by and swing by and have some hot hot chocolate they can have some eggnog they can have coffee and we have just finger food hors d'oeuvres and we have uh um, just different things to drink and everything and they come by and just you know spend a little time and just you know spend a little holiday time because everyone's going to be busy throughout the the christmas season and spending christmas with their family and so um this would be nice to have in the bathrooms or just to put inside their little thank you basket or little thank you gift pack when they come by but i purchased that one and this one with the hollies <clears throat> you get 15 in each one and then this one so just to get me started, because like I said, it just kind of took me by surprise that they had their Christmas things out. And a lot of their autumn things are already 50% off, so I'll probably go back tomorrow because I'm not done decorating my front door uh, for my, um, <clears throat> Christ or my, my autumn. And let me give you just a sneak peek of just what I did real quick. I'm going to change it, but I don't know if you can see that. That's my, my little, my dining room table, what it's set up for for autumn right now and um, you really can't see it but I just thought I'd give you give you a shot at it but uh, but that's what I purchased so far um, uh, when I went to Staples I guess it was yesterday I picked up this post-it note pad that had pad uh, that has the crabs on it and then I picked up two more Hello Kitty uh, notepads and so and I think that is it you know, I, I did buy some things at Walmart, but like I said, it was just more of like toiletries and things like that. Oh, I did go see my mother on Saturday, and we went to Daiso, and I'm trying to find my bag of the stuff that I bought out of Daiso with her, and is this it? Oh yeah, this is it. I bought these tissues. Okay, I bought these tissues. I also bought these, and I split some with my mother because she loves polka dots, so I bought those. And then I went ahead and I purchased two of these um, pockets, the pink one and the yellow one. Okay, the lace pockets. And I bought some more message cards. I bought those. And I bought these message cards. Look how cute that is. And look at the envelope. Isn't that just adorable? And then I bought these, and that's what the envelopes look on those. Kind of matches the polka dots on the tissues. I also purchased these birthday cards that, oh, this is what it looks like. You open it up, and you push here. It plays happy birthday. So... And you can put that, you know, write their name there, put a little message there. And I bought this one as well. So my thought process was to take it apart and put it in a card that I make myself. So try to buy that at uh, Hallmark. That was only $1.50. I try, I'm trying one more of these mechanical pens with a pencil in there, the four and one. Let's see if that works. Then I purchased this um, shopping bag. Yes, this is actually a shopping bag crammed into itself. And so that's what the picture, that's what it looks like. So I went ahead and I bought one of those. So this turns into this, which is this. That's a shopping bag that will stay in the car. I bought a, a red glue tape to go in my black or my, my uh, Nicole Miller day timer set. And then I bought these shoe covers for my husband for when he go, goes and does work in residential homes. And maybe these will fit over his boots. I just bought one pack. And 
if these work for him, then I will go and I will buy more for him because sometimes he does work in residential homes and, um, you know, you just don't want to walk into their home in your, in your work boots, you know, so I bought those for him. So that's it, everyone. I saw the um, happy mail that Cory received from Char. From Char, Char, and and Char, let me know if I'm saying your name right. I know you said it. Is it Chari? Because you said it's not pronounced like my name. So is it Char, Chari, like Charlie, but take out the the L for Charlie. So I'm hoping I'm pronouncing your name right. Uh, who lumps times four? You were saying that maybe there's a way that we can all get on here at the same time and journal together well there is a thing called youtube live i'm not sure if i can do it because i have not upgraded my youtube channel but maybe someone who has already upgraded their youtube youtube channel has access to youtube live so i'll check it out a little bit more and everyone else check it out a little bit more because i think that would be a lot of fun if we did a collective journaling at the same time where we're live with each other and we can interact with each other i think that would be great um, there were a couple of other comments that were made in someone else's videos that I was watching and I wanted to address them here um, but I guess that's it okay so that's what I purchased in the last couple of days um, I think it's because I'm getting ready to go into surgery I'm just kind of like doing some therapy shopping <laughs> so um, I'm enjoying it Okay, I'm enjoying it. And I hope you are too. Thank you so much, everyone, for your time. And I love watching all your happy mails and your racks and just everything, seeing all your flip throughs on your, your Hobonichis and your Fobonichis. And yes, I'm going to post my picture as soon as I finish this video. I'm going to post my my page on, on Facebook of, of in the uh, Fobonichi group. So I'll get that done. And that is about it everyone have a fabulous tuesday and uh i'll be seeing you in a couple of days i'm not sure if i'm going to be on the radio on thursday because i have to go in for post-op and um got to do some testing and everything and depending on what time i get up there and i get back i may not be back in time to do my radio show so i think i will have someone fill in for me on thursday so i don't feel rushed um that's about it. That's everything in a nutshell. Thank you so much, everyone. If I don't see you soon, I'll definitely see you in the next video. And as always, I want you to be blessed. Bye-bye now.